kawaii. Of our way to Finland, Helsinki. And so that's going to be our uh, ship or our ferry. It's, go, it's called Megastar. Yeah, I'm very excited because uh, this is my second time to go to Helsinki. My first time was back in 2015, and so I'm not couldn't recall it anymore. But even so, recording now. Catch up with you later. Here in Helsinki and I'm very excited to actually share this experience with all of you because the last time that I've been here was actually was almost five years ago and it was during winter season so this time around it's summer and it's going to be a different vibe so right now I'm here with my friend and we're going to explore the city together and I'm very happy to show you guys and take you guys along with me as I explore the city of Helsinki Tchau, There's a bazaar um, going on, there's food stores and there's an outlet where you can buy some stuff, um, souvenirs, um, indigenous items or uh, items items that the locals have made uh, to, to sell to the tourists. And also, yeah, there's, on the other side, there's also an area where you can eat probably um, Finnish food. So I'm not so sure, but we're going to check that later. But anyway, this area is filled with that. Um, and, and if you are keen to buying uh, souvenirs and uh, if you want to take a piece of Finland uh, with you, what's well, better to go here and buy the stuff. Uh, 
Uh, ano ba? Akala ko sabi mo kakain na tayo. Kakain na ba tayo? Ah, oh, sige. Monument, which is a sculpture by Elia Tilman, and this is actually dedicated to one of the famous uh, composer here in Finland, which is uh, John Sibelius. So, as you can see, uh, there are so many tourists uh, going around and having a glimpse and taking a picture of this area. So, anyway, uh, right now we are done in this area and we're heading to a uh, different place. So, let's check out the other uh, parts of the uh, in one of the parks here in Helsinki and my friend is obviously enjoying his time so what can you say about Helsinki do you enjoy oh my god your stay here I'm so desperate <laughs> so is it the same in uh, in the states uh, or how is it different in the states it's um, the architecture here is more preserved and um, yeah. I love how they you know, preserve the old arch architecture and then the streets and also tram. tram. At the trams, yeah. Yes. So that's we have trams in uh, Bay Area, but not like here. Like the whole city yeah. was running by the, I mean, the old trams. They yeah. have the old trams running around the whole city of Helsinki. Yep. So that's basically true. Uh, here in Helsinki, they do operate, they, they have a lot of uh, trams operating in the city and aside from that there's also buses and other forms of transportation such as um, scooters they also have it here so yeah uh It is something that I never imagined. Yeah, it has been a very amazing experience here, especially during summertime. So my trip here has completely changed the way I see Helsinki because before, the very first time that I've been to Helsinki, it was uh, during winter time and it was totally different from what I see today. 
ever there's going to be another chance, I'll be able, I really wanted to come back here um, and explore more of the city or probably the other side of Finland. And yeah, I also hope that you enjoy watching this video. And if you do, just consider subscribing to the channel and click the notification bell icon so you won't miss any of my future videos and contents. Um, so this is going to be it for me for today. See you in my next video. Travel and adventure.